Next in our form and function series is Natasha Miller. She's working out of Miami, Florida, and uses a bright sterling silver in most of her work, but some of it is oxidized silver. This one-of-a-kind necklace has a black jade set right in the center there. This is her wing ring with seraphonite. Natasha Miller is really exceptional at using sterling silver bars to create 3D forms. As you're gonna see in this next ring coming up, it stands really tall off the hand. It's hollow in the center there. This is her petal ring with turquoise. It is impossible for this ring to get ignored if you wear it out to a cocktail party. And the last piece we're gonna look at in this video is the Lauren. She patterns the sterling silver bars in a really beautiful way in this cuff and has a bezel set Larimer stone in the center. Come back for the rest of her work. Now time for part two of Natasha Miller. We're gonna be looking at her earrings. First is this swinging triangle pair. All the triangles are kinetic except for those center two that were fixed. These cage-like earrings create a nice dimension when worn in the ear. And these orbital earrings are already in a new home. All of them so far have been bright sterling silver and these have a swinging nail that was halved and set into each earring. Then for her oxidized silver earrings, we have these one-of-a-kind asymmetrical earrings with lilac jadeite and hinges with a 14 karat gold accent. These are her maca earrings in oxidized bronze with sterling silver posts. And that's all for Natasha Miller. Visit our website for more.